a look at the order of operations. We'll start with the expression parentheses 4 plus 7 minus 3, close the parentheses, plus 10 divided by 5. And remember, the order of operations tells us to do parentheses first. So we're going to focus in on the calculations that need to be done inside of this parentheses. We're going to do those in order from left to right. So we're going to add the 4 plus 7 minus 3. Be sure and use your calculator if you need help with that calculation, just to double check yourself. But 4 plus 7 gives us 11. 11 minus 3 gives us 8. Notice that I replaced the parentheses with the value I got. So now I no longer have a parentheses. I just have an 8 in that place. Now, um, order of operations would normally tell us to go to exponents next, but there's not one. So we get to skip that step. And our next step then is to multiply or divide in order from left to right. So we naturally would look at this problem and want to add the 8 plus the 10 first, but we have to follow that order of operations. So 10 divided by 5 gives me 2. Notice I replace that division with the 2. And then finally, I finish up by adding 8 plus 2 to give me 10. I like this problem because I also want to show you how you can do it on your calculator. Now, if you have not taken a chance to download an app for your phone, there are some free ones. And I did a video just on graphing calculator apps. So you might want to check that out. But just so you know, the name of the apps for the Android is the Wabbit with a W, Wabbit. And then for the iPhone, there are some that are, there are some that are exactly like this calculator, um, but they're also a free one. So the free one is called EduCalc Classic. What I like to show in this problem is that you can type in this problem just as it is, parentheses and all in the graphing calculator, which is why I do suggest for this class that people do Go ahead and do the app. It's a couple of dollars, even if you have to pay for one of them. But it's a really nice way to check your calculations. 